South Korean politicians inspected the Kaesong Industrial Park on Wednesday as part of an ongoing parliamentary audit session. Earlier in the day, 47 South Korean politicians, including 21 lawmakers from the National Assembly's Foreign Affairs and Unification Committee, crossed the border into North Korea for the inspection. Seoul's Yonhap News Television reported the lawmakers were briefed by the head of the Kaesong Industrial District Management Committee, Hong Yang Ho, and looked over factories that make clothes, shoes and parts for mobile phones. In April, Pyongyang pulled its 53,000 workers out of the park at the height of the nuclear tensions between the two sides, as it threatened the United States and the South with missile attacks. On September 11th, North and South Korea agreed to reopen the shuttered Kaesong Industrial Park on September 16th. Since it opened in 2004, the Kaesong Industrial Complex has generated roughly 90 million US dollars annually in wages, paid directly to the North State Agency that manages the zone.